postseason was the pinnacle of the Big Red Machine era. It was the club's second straight World Series title and the historic exclamation point on a dominant run that found the club winning five division titles, four pennants, and two world championships from 1970 to 1976. Like all great baseball dynasties, the Big Red Machine was a team that was built over time with pieces being added season after season until a nearly lawless club was formed. The construction of the machine began in the 1960s as the club's farm system produced Pete Rose, Tony Perez, Lee May, Tommy Elms, Gary Nolan, and Johnny Bench, each of whom blossomed into stars under the tutelage of then-manager Dave Bristol. A critical addition was made in 1967 when Bob Hausen took over as general manager, now universally known as the architect of the Big Red Machine. Hausen took a team on the cusp of greatness and turned it into a dynasty. In the first six years of the new decade, Hausen hired Sparky Anderson as manager and oversaw the promotion from the minor leagues of David Concepcion, Don Gully, Ken Griffey, Raleigh Eastwick, Will McEnany, and Pat Zachary. And he engineered blockbuster trades that brought George Foster, Joe Morgan, Jack Billingham, Cesar Geronimo, Ed Armbrister, and Fred Norman to the Reds. By 1975, the machine's fabled grade 8 starting lineup had solidified. That lineup, girded by a strong starting pitching staff, durable and effective bullpen, and a deep and versatile assemblage of reserve players, combined to form a team that had no weakness. While the club was pushed to a seventh game before emerging victorious in the 1975 World Series, the 1976 Reds simply overwhelmed their opposition in the postseason, sweeping both the league championship series and World Series. The Reds' 1976 season was the culmination of over a decade of work by an organization whose sole focus was on winning championships on field and off. The Reds of 1976 represented a collection of talent the likes of which may never be seen again. Forty years later, this legend continues to grow. And that is as it should be, for the greatness exhibited by the Big Red Machine is exceedingly rare and must be admired and celebrated always. And now, please direct your attention to the field and join us in welcoming back the 1976 World Champions, starting with the reserves. Number 42, pitcher, Santorakala. Good. 